So, a Nigerian journalist has called for the prosecution of DJ Switch, the DJ that was present at the Lekki Tollgate massacre. Come on in, let us dissect, let's analyze. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Gist Lovers. If you're seeing my face for the first time, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Subscribe, like, and share this video. All right, so a Nigerian journalist named Bolahan Magjob called for persecution of DJ Switch. Now, DJ Switch was the DJ that was present at the Lekki Target massacre. When they started shooting people, she took her phone and she went on her Instagram live and she was telling the world what was happening. And in her own words, she said, at the time she started the live, she said five people, her five or seven people has been shot. By the time she finished, it was about 15 people that were shot already. And now this journalist came out from nowhere to say that everything that she said is not true and that no one should believe what dj switch said and she that she's lying and she's trying to deceive everyone all over the world that not even her cnn interview is going to help her she's not going to get asylum if she's trying to seek for a foreign asylum to you know and, and stuff like that that she should be persecuted because she's lying and she's trying to mislead people and you know something there is this Nigerian man that released the video during the beginning of this NSAS um, stuff and he said it. He said the youths, you people don't know who or the kind of people you people are up against. These people will do everything to make sure that this, your NSAS is not successful. And he said it. He said journalists will be paid. Um, influencers, uh, social media um, you know, personalities and stuff like that. Celebrities will be bribed to say contrary, to walk contrary to what you people are doing. So you people have to stay strong and stay focused. And this is exactly what is happening because from where did this bowler hand, this man with a very boring name, from he just came out of nowhere to start telling people that DJ Switch should be arrested. Really? Your problem is DJ Switch? Even if, okay, let's, let's say the Lek Lekki massacre didn't happen. Do you really like the way the politicians are ruling the country? Do you like the way we have poor people, people are suffering and the way the police treat people? Okay, look at the COVID-19 palliative. They hid it all. They didn't give it out to people. So all of this you're telling me as a journalist that you love it. Shame on you. Shame on you to call for the arrest of an innocent lady that is working hard to put food on her table and you call on the Nigerian government to arrest her. Have you called on the Nigerian government to arrest those politicians that steal billions upon billions of Nigerian money? And you stand here to tell people this bullshit. You call yourself a journalist. What kind of journalist are you? Shame on you. But the truth will prevail. At the end of the day, we will see if it's DJ Sweet that is lying or the fools like you. Anyway, guys. All right, guys. I will stop here. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this very nasty tweet that this so-called fake journalist put out on social media calling for the arrest and the persecution of DJ Switch. Let me know. For now, I'm out. Bye, guys.